I'm Shani Gandhi. Um, I'm a producer, engineer, mixer based in Nashville, Tennessee. Well, I started playing piano at the age of three, violin at maybe six, cello at like eight, just all the good, you know, classical instruments. Um, I was in choirs, bands, all that stuff, but I really hated performing. So I never thought of this being a career and it wasn't until I found out that there was this behind the board situation that I was like, oh my gosh, this is it, this is me. Andrew Mendelssohn at Georgetown was the one who saved me and actually gave me an internship when I didn't have one anymore. Um, and then whilst I was there, I met Reid Shippen and he was actually the one, um, we went out and got a beer after like my first day there and, and he was like, you should move to Nashville, it's where you need to be. I was like, I don't know about that. He's like, no, that's what you need to do, you know, if you know Reid. Um, <laughs> and I was like, oh, okay. So I did, he was the first person who was like, you've got potential, you should do this. And I listened and I'm glad I did. I first moved to town and started working for um, Michael Wagner. There was actually, I think it was a band from um, Edmonton, Canada um, called Striker. I think it was those guys and they were amazing. Um, and then when I, when I really started doing um, more of the America, Americana folk stuff, which I guess is more what I'm known for now, I think the first artist was Sarah Droz. I think, oh, I think one of my favorite things about this job is that it's always different. Like I, I could find a job that paid me like five million dollars a year but if I had to do the same thing every day I would go nuts. I'm just that person so thank god I found this job. So I wanted to be a part of the creation. There's the obsession with, um, with sound and the intricacies of miking and the little details I really think came much later but I just wanted to be part of the creative process. I think I support the art. Like I make people's art come to life but I'm not a, I can't create something from nothing, like, like, a, like a songwriter or a novelist or anything like that does. And I'm also sometimes kind of grateful for that because it's not always me and my like personality on the table for everyone to, you know, see and judge. It's I'm just there supporting the real creators, which I just adore. What's up, y'all? This is B.O.B. This is G-Eazy. I'm Mo. This is Julia Michaels. This is Logic. Make sure you subscribe to the Recording Academy channel. Flex.